Hi, I'm Christine and I'm part of the Teams team here at Microsoft. With all of us spending hours of our days working online, it's more important than ever to know how to collaborate both effectively and safely. I'll be sharing some ways to do just that in your Teams meetings before it started, while it's going on, and after you have wrapped up. Let's get started. Before your meeting starts, use the pre-meeting settings to be set up for success. Open up the meeting in your Teams calendar and select Meeting Options. From the pop-up, adjust your settings by choosing who will be able to present and who can bypass the lobby. When you are in your meeting and someone is being disruptive, you can use the in-meeting options to help. From here, you can temporarily mute participants yourself or even disable their mic and camera for the rest of the meeting. If you are too busy, you can also promote a trusted teammate to join you as a presenter to help manage the meeting while you're leading it. After your meeting is over, if someone is no longer involved in your project, be sure to remove them from your future meetings and conversations. Open up your team's calendar and click on the team meeting you are trying to manage. Click the X next to their name in the invite list to remove them. Once removed, they will still have access to everything during the time they were included, but will not see anything new. These are just a few ways you can host safe and effective online meetings. Try it out and see what works best for you. For more Teams tips, how-tos, and to see what else is possible with Microsoft Teams, subscribe today.